SPCHR changes your sprite uh, that is associated with a, a sprite ID. In this example, we'll take your cat from the SPOFS tutorial and make it so that the sprite changes depending on what direction it's facing. SPCHR starts off with your sprite ID, then the U and V of the sprite sheet location. Uh, of the sp It's the sp location of the sprite that you want to use on the sprite sheet. And the fourth parameter gets tricky. And the fourth parameter is used to rotate the sprite. And since the default sprite sheet only has sprites that are walking right and not left, you have to use this to flip them. This took me about 30 minutes to figure out, not because the instructions are in Japanese, but because it just didn't make sense the way they did it. The fourth parameter is in binary, but the numbers don't correspond to the ones in the directions, which leads me to believe that it's either in binary coded decimal or gray code or something of that sort. Or, you know, I could have just gotten lucky, you know, entering in binary numbers, and it could require something totally different. Either way, I use 1001 in the fourth parameter to flip the cat from facing right to facing left.